Hi guys, this is David with Media Unlocked coming at you with another tutorial today about a little plugin I came across the other day and purchased called Magic Bullet Looks. <laughs> now what Magic Bullet Looks allows you to do is go in and color your video or add like a tent or a filter into the video as well. Um, the other really cool thing about this plugin, it is not a Mac only plugin. It works for Final Cut Pro, uh, uh, Apple Color, it works for Adobe Premiere and After Effects, both for Mac and PC, and Sony Vegas, and there might and Avid as well, I believe. And there also might be a few other platforms that it works on. But those are the ones I know off the top of my head. So today I'm going to show you one kind of what it does and the basics of editing it. I've only had it for a couple of days, so I'm not an expert at it, but it's a really cool plugin for your uh, video editing softwares. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to drag and drop a clip in. Um, now, as you can see, this video um, that my guy, that my video guy shot, if you notice, is really blue, um, and he didn't white balance it at all, which is extremely frustrating. So uh, when I popped into the editor and I was going to edit it, I was like, "Oh wow, this guy screwed it up." Anyways, you got to live with it. So I'm going to drop it into my timeline. Uh, I'm going to double click on this, uh, and then I'm going to go to Effects, Video Filters. Magic Bullet. I'm going to click on Looks. Now, you, there are some preset looks that you can do right there, but I like to go in and actually use this really cool thing. And it actually drags and dro drops into like its own separate little editing thing. Um, now, you have some of your tools are over here if you want to do like a custom look. And how you do like if you want to do a custom look, you'll just drag this over here. And uh, so, say I want to do work on my saturation. So I'm going to, and you bring it up on the video, and you can drop it into, depending on where you want to edit it. So we want to edit it right in subject. So we're going to drag it up there, and you can actually go in and do your editing right here if you were to do different looks and stuff. So there's a bunch of different tools. You can scroll down, and then you can go under. Um, there's all kinds of really cool-looking tools that you can do. And uh, if you want to do this, like I said, if you want to do it custom, you just bring it over here and then drop it where you want it to go. So um, certain things I think can only go in certain um, categories here. So that's like the first thing you can do. Um, secondly, let's go on and let's get rid of these looks here. You can click on these little red tabs right here, and this cancels out the look. This gets you back to your normal, what your normal look was before. Now you've got preset looks, which are really cool. Um, and I'll read them down, read some of them down. you got like music video, popular film, popular TV, custom, uh, diffusion, horror. Um, so if you don't want to spend the time and actually color it yourself, the cool thing is you can get a preset look if you like one of those. So we could go to like popular film, um, and it will go in, and as you can see, it gives me, <laughs> gives me this. So uh, one look I really like was I think under popular TV. And it has this like kind of old, old kind of tint to it, and it actually recolors my video, and it looks a lot better now than what it looked before. So this is what it looked like. This is what the video looked like before. So let's go on and cancel all these guys out. So, um, so uh, cancel and cancel. So this is what the video looked like before. Now, if we get rid of these, we go on and add them back in. This is what it looks like now. And as you can see, it looks a little bit better. Now, this isn't a, this is still off a little bit, but I kind of like this, this, like, uh, this feel to it, the warmer tones, and uh, it definitely looks a lot better than it did before. So, um, so this is like the basics of Magic Bullet looks, and I just kind of wanted to show it to you guys. Also, if you look down below, um, I came across a video where the guy claims um, that if you click on a link underneath his video, you can actually get this program for free. I know I paid a pretty penny for it, but this guy claims that if you uh, click on his link and uh, you can download it for free. Um, I have nothing to do with this. Just came across, thought I would drop it in. So uh, if you look at my pants bar below, uh, there'll be a link, and you can check out that guy's video and at your own disclosure if you want to download his so-called free version. Um, then go for it. But I have nothing to do with it. I just wanted to put that out there. Also, check us out on Twitter and uh, as well on Skype. Um, I do I do try to be on Skype as much as possible. I'm in film school, so I'm <laughs> I'm gone for five or six hours a day, 
in film school learning. Right now we're learning script writing, and oh, I hate it so much. Anyways, that's neither here nor there. Uh, but yeah, check us out on Skype. Um, all that information will be at the end of the video. And uh, also, if you have any uh, anything you'd like to see me do or tutorials, then uh, leave me a comment, send me a message. I'd be more than happy to help you out with that.